to make it long. And so it begins. July 28th, 5.06 p.m. The Eagles Theater. We are in Wabash, Indiana. First time here at this beautiful theater. I'll give a quick little tour of the snippets of the inside here after I'm done blabbering. But we just finished sound check. It was about a three hour drive, I think, from Kevin's house. I think showtime's around nine o'clock, something like that. There's no opening act tonight. Pretty good news about the ticket sales. The ticket sales are looking pretty good here today. This is the beginning of a long four day weekend, baby. It's gonna be good times. Bobby's all hyped up, got his samurai hair, and he's ready to go. He's we'll see you in a bit. Come here, Bobby. Let's uh, check out this hair you've been working on here. What were you going for, Bobby? There was a model here you're going for with that hair, oh, isn't there? It's uh, Terry Silver from Cobra Kai. Terry Silver once, from Cobra once Kai. Once I get it pulled back like this, yeah. I'll, I'll have you got a Terry Silver thing you want to say? No, strike no. first, strike hard, no mercy. That's so typical, don't use that. Seven twenty nine. Here we are, a minute from showtime. Here they come! Boom, boom, boom. We've got a great set ready. Check out quick little spread here. Look at it. We got our nice little green room, dressing room, early show, seven thirty. It's looking real nice out there. It's looking real good. Later, later. Ten forty p.m. Wabash, Indiana, the Eagles Theater. Excellent attendance, excellent crowd interaction. The energy through tonight was great. Kevin, anything on tonight? Awesome show, brother. Great it's crowd. Home run off to a great start. That's right. Heading to Nebraska overnight. Lincoln, Nebraska is our next stop. I think we got nine hours, something like that. Probably go into the morning, and uh, I think we're gonna stop at a truck stop and sleep before we get to the Royal Grove. Well, it's been a long time since we've been there. And, yeah. And really, as far as Nebraska, I don't know that we've been anywhere it's the else only in spot Nebraska. I, can I think of. that's the only place we've ever been. We really like to see a lot of you come out. Hopefully, we have a great show there tomorrow night. Yeah, fingers are crossed. Lincoln, Nebraska, see you there. 2.40 p.m. Nine hours from good old Wabash, Indiana. We have returned to the Royal Grove. I think me and Kevin are the only two people who were here last time this band was here. It was probably like three or four years ago. It was a while ago. And uh, I'd like to be honest with you folks, we didn't have too many people here last time, but hopefully tonight it's way better, man. I'm telling you, Andrew, my fingers are crossed, but I ain't holding my breath. It's Friday night, Lincoln, Nebraska, the Corn Huskers. Come on, Corn Huskers, I believe in you. What were you guys talking about? Can't do that on Can't television. Do that on television. Hey, dude. Another one. God, those are two I don't remember. The starting point for Alanis Morissette. Salute your shorts. Yeah, that, uh, Danny I'm gonna put Alanis Morissette right here in the show you guys are talking about because I don't know what the fuck and I'm sure there's people watching this who don't know what the fuck but I still don't know what the fuck if you did watch Nickelodeon hey let us know in the comments baby let us know what you watched we love it man we watch love this watch out for uh, Brian's new autobiography coming soon what's the title? Myron not Byron my life on the stage and in the ring book tour featuring Brian Johnson and Mick Foley I'm gonna call it your lack of Whatever. <laughs> <laughs>
25. Look at it. Look at the walls. Rock and roll. Covered walls. People have been here. Apparently, there's a motorhead thing here. Apparently, Lemmy was here. For the record, sound check today took like 10 hours. The guy spent like 20 minutes on each drum. It was fucking torture, folks. But hey, we're here. There's about 40 people here, and I've got Johnny Walker. Did you say 40? Yeah. Oh. What do, we, what do we got, Brian? Give it to us. 15? All right. I was right. Well, I was right. Johnny Walker's coming in fucking hot tonight. It's still going to be a good night, man. I'm going to have a great time. I'm going to have a fun show. I'll see you in a bit. Is that Tony Walker? Yeah, it is. You want some? Yeah. He's going to drink all of it. Oh. Have you never had it? I've had it. I love it. Eleven oh five p.m. I'm sitting here with Kevin Feller. I got Gloria Feller here. Lincoln, Nebraska, in the books. Royal Grove. Let's just say um, it went the way I was thinking. Um, but, but the 25, 30 people that were there, they had a good time. They were dancing. They were grooving. It was a great time. Fucking bless. Kevin, you got anything you want to say about tonight? I mean, hey, it was uh, intimate, little setting, but. Hey, everybody that was here was up and had a good time, so... Yeah, that's mean, all we could ask for. We gave them the show like we always say we do, and, uh... Yeah, so, You know, there's gonna be nights like that. They said happens. they had, what, 40 bands downtown for $12? Yeah, 40 <laughs> bands downtown in, like, in Nebraska for $12. The thing else I also heard was the, the ticket link was non-existent. The ticket link didn't so work. People that went to there was like, it wasn't hey, working. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Like, I'm just, these are the things that I heard. But. Anyways, Arnold's Park, we're coming. I think we only got like four hour drive tomorrow. Not too long of a drive. So, shouldn't be too bad at all. I put quite a bit of work into my Johnny Walker. And I'm feeling great. And um, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> 3.57 p.m. Sound checks in the books. Arnold's Park. We are back. It's the summertime special. And it's going to be a good show. Sound check's done. It was sounding great. I popped my snare. So I had to put a new snare on and away we went. We always have a good crowd here. Good time. And tonight, then we got to drive straight from this place to Toledo, Ohio. Lotus. Ohio. And we're going to the Northwest Ribboff. That's where we're going. To Lotus, Lotus tomorrow. And it's a 5 p.m. show tomorrow, early show tomorrow. So probably going to be a little hot. Looking forward to it. Looking forward to the ribs. And we're looking forward to all the Ohioans showing up tonight and tomorrow. And Iowans. Ohioans, Ohioans, Iowans, Ohioans. Iowans tonight. Ohioans I, yeah, tomorrow. there we go. Chris got me. <laughs> Anytime, See you in a bit. 4.20 p.m. Change of plans. We're going on a roller coaster. I got Brian Meeks next to me. We got these jabronis. <laughs> she said I can't vlog. Never mind. <laughs> I, I'm a rule breaker, mother <laughs> I don't hope you lose your phone, but it would be a really good vlog. <laughs> Hey, 
Yep, one. All right, roller coaster reviews. Here we go. I'm gonna start it off at a 10, 6.5. That gets some nostalgia. But you know, vintage points. Could have been a little bit longer. Went by real fast. Kevin, what do you got? I'll go seven just because I like all that old vintage stuff. Kind of reminds me of days of yesteryear when I was a child. <laughs> so yeah, it, it was fun. It was was a little too short. But I, I think it was, for, for being what it was, it was relative, they, they relatively say, quick, you know. Did they say how long it's been there? No, no, it's been there a long time. It's been there long, a while. Yeah. Bobby, roller coaster review out of 10? I give it a 6. Okay. It was, it was a good little starter ride, but you know, I like King's Island. Roller coaster review out of 10? 3. 3 out of 10. Out of 10? 5.76. Tyler? I'm going to do it probably 6. Show them the uh, Giant Dipper from Santa Cruz Beach One Life. All right, we're gonna put that right here above Tyler. What's it called one more time? The, the Big Dipper, the Giant Dipper from the Beach Boardwalk in Santa Cruz. That's the 10 out of 10. I'd like to change my answer from 5.76. It was a 10 because I did it with my friends. Any change in rating for you, three out of 10? No. 8.26. PM. It is filling up here at Arnold's Park. I'll show it when I'm done blabbering. Jamie Swenson's here. We played our birthday party. We're gonna give it to him, baby. Arnold's Park is gonna fucking get it today like always. I'm drinking coffee, though, because I'm tired and we got a long night ahead of us. See you in a bit. Check out the crowd, though. Check it out, baby. Check it out. Look. There we go. Yeah. And look. Nice fancy new stage here, baby. It looks real good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I got the bell behind me tonight. Eleven oh seven p.m. Standing here next to Brian Meeks, tearing down the stage. Brian's got an idea. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get the security guy with the double axe hammer, Corey. All right, it's gonna be funny. Watch it. <laughs> yeah! Oh, to the camera! To the camera! Got it! <laughs> 3 46 p.m. 11 and a half hours driven all the way from Arnold's Park, Iowa to now Toledo, Ohio. We are at the rib off and uh, it smells delicious. Just finished sound check in, three o'clock sound check, and uh, show time is five o'clock. So uh, we're gonna be going on here in about an hour, 15 minutes. Everybody's pretty tired. See you in a bit. <laughs> Four fifty p.m. Ten minutes from showtime. Everybody's ready to go. Everybody's feeling tired. But we got some rock and roll to do in here. Let me find the crowd here. Is anybody here, Bobby? Uh, there's a few people gathering around. I'm feeling supersonic. There's plenty of room to be filled. I don't know where Brian Meeks is. Uh, he's having a little neck issues today, dude. I think that Andre the Giant guy yesterday really kind of fucked him up. Hey, Brian, how's your neck feeling today? What? How's your neck feeling today? I think it feels okay. I mean, I, I can move it pretty well. Uh, 
Yeah, so. Go right. What do you do we think about doing for the video? You want to do some let's get it up? What? Let's get it up. Let's get it, let's see. Can you get that neck up? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think I could do let's get up. No, really, guys, my neck feels fine. Uh, what? Yeah, yeah, okay. Seven thirty eight p.m. Wrapped. The Northwest rib off is over. It was hot. It was steamy. It was stinky. Nipples were tingling. We made it through it, baby. We made it. It is now over. We are heading home. Five hours to Little Ohio to Louisville, and Tyler's got the extra fucking two and a half hours back to Nashville. On to next weekend. Decatur, Indiana. Decatur summer concert series right in the middle of downtown. Should be a great time. I don't know if it's indoor or outdoor, but we'll find out. And then. Friday, we are going Jeffersonville, Indiana. The River Stage, always a great time at the fucking River Stage in fucking Jeffersonville. It's a free show, so anybody in that area wants to come out here, some ACDC, have a good time, hang out by the river. That's where you can find us next Friday. And then Saturday, another killer show. We're going to Lazy Acres Campground, Nashport, Ohio. Always a great time there. I think it's like a $25 cover. See you then. That is when I pulled out good old Dusty, old and rusty, good old Dusty, yeah. true and true. That is when I pulled out good old Dusty. I wasn't supposed to be back. Wasn't supposed to be here, internet. This was not supposed to happen. 10.56 p.m. Brian's in a lot of pain. My heart hurts because we're two hours from Louisville, man, and boom, pop goes the weasel. All right, tire blew up, folks. The tread just blew completely off that motherfucker. And of course, it's the inside one. We got some guy coming to fix it, but it's just the end of the, you know, the cherry on the top of that Sunday, baby. Twelve twenty-two. We thought we had it, but he was missing a socket. He drove away, and here comes Rich again. Take two. Twelve thirty-three. We've got two of them out here now. I think between the two of them, we're gonna get a fix. Believe in the dream, baby. They're already making progress. They're making progress. The bus is up, baby. The tire is coming off, baby. We're gonna be going home soon, baby. We got a brand new tire. Brand new fucking tire. This thing fucking blew up. Brand new. Just bought those. I drove for 10 minutes and that mother exploded. Chris Jones should have just taken it in. Why the fuck did you let me drive, Chris? You fucked up. I had faith in you and that was my mistake. And then we drove by fucking... I thought, we drove thought I by could Jesus. Trust somebody else to take care of something for once and this is what he happened. He put the wheel in my hand and Jesus says, hell no. Thanks a lot, Jesus. Well, we got bopped by Christ. Gotcha, bitch.